So just like I said in the last video, this video I wanted to talk to you about getting enough sleep and the importance of that. So let's start from the beginning. If your mind is not working correctly in the morning because it hasn't gotten enough rest, it's not going to work well enough to resist OCD as well as it could. So the most important thing is that you get enough rest. Your mind is overworked. It's doing two processes at the same time. It's doing your regular life processes, you know, trying to process the situations of your real life as well as processing OCD situations. So to give it that power that it needs to function properly, you need to give it enough rest. How do we do that? Before going to bed, first of all, make sure that you're wearing comfortable clothing, that you're relaxed, that you're prepared for bed. You want to make sure that you are um, not watching uh, screens that are emitting blue light at least two hours before bed. So cell phones, uh, tablets of any kind, all of this is emitting blue light into your eye. And that changes how your, um, basically how your brain interprets the upcoming sleep. Because blue light from the uh, from technology devices, especially the latest ones, um, is, simu is simulating daylight. And your mind thinks that it's the day, you're just taking a nap. So your uh, melatonin levels are getting mixed up and that causes your serotonin levels to get mixed up. So, so it's not being produced as it should. And of course, you know about the serotonin and OCD and all of that. So, and I'm just saying, uh, th there's more to it than that. And it's, it really makes a difference. Trust me, you know, actually you don't have to trust me. Try it for one night. No devices before bed, if this is your regular pattern of just like browsing on, on like the phone or whatever. So try it for one night, you will see how much more refreshed you are in the morning. If you can't fall asleep, get yourself one of those little tiny mp3 players. Here they are about like 10 bucks or something like that, you can get them in any electronics store. Just really, really, the cheapest one you can get basically. Throw some music on it or throw some uh, audio books on it and listen to the audio. It First of all, it will divert your attention when you're laying down. And second of all, it will help you fall asleep. But it doesn't have that screen. It probably, most of the time, it just has like one line that shows what MP3 you are playing, like what music file you're playing. So it's not going to hurt your, um, like your levels and all of that. So, um, so that's what I suggest for that. Um, the other thing... Make sure that you have adequate oxygen supply. When you're going to bed, make sure that your, your room is well ventilated. Especially if there's more than one person sleeping in the room, make sure that air is circulating. And ideally, depending on the area you live in, if you could do that, if you cannot, try to sleep with a window at least a little bit open so there's fresh air coming in constantly. And before you're going to bed, air out the room so you get maximum fresh air in. So that, that will help as well because you want to make sure that you're having the best sleep possible and obviously oxygen is a big part of that. Also, you want to make sure you are comfortable and obviously, like I said, wear comfortable clothing. Make sure that you have, that you're in, in a good condition to get a perfect rest. Trust me when I say all of these things, they're not trivial. They may seem trivial, but trust me when I say they're not. Just try them for one night and you will see a difference. Another thing is try to do meditation or if you're a religious person, do a prayer before going to bed. It puts you in the right zone, in the right mood and, and also helps you drift off to sleep better. Thank you so much for listening. If you would like more information, you can visit youhaveocd.com. There's a private recovery program there with me. There's also books available. There's a lot of free information on OCD, so please check that out. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.